What's up everybody? Today I've got the first off the line 2020 Panini Chronicles Baseball. This was shipped via express mail overnight. It got here quick. I love Chronicles. It's a really fun product. It was fun with basketball this year and last year was really great for baseball too. It was super affordable last year for the amount of hits you get, the quality of hits. And this year, here it is. You get to look at it first before everybody else. We get three autographs, one memorabilia card, eight cards per pack, six packs per box, the FOTL sticker, let's go. Let's take a quick look on the back here, see if there's anything. Hmm. Yeah, there's always just, it's just this panini, all of this, it's gotta go. You gotta organize this a little bit better or something. It's like, you, you can't even see what's going on. You can't even try, but let's do this. The good luck thing. We're sweeping away the bad luck with Bud Selig and his ridiculous, ridiculous hairpiece. Everybody knows, bud. You're not fooling anyone. We're doing the double good luck soak with Clayton Claws and Kluber Claws. And to top things off, a bill hook. Hook it. We're gonna hook it good. And I'm not gonna get cut. Yes, okay. Got through it without getting cut. Everybody's a winner. We're gonna be filling these stands up at the very least. My goal is to get a bow, a nice bow, a parallel would be sweet. Bo Bichette drives this one into center field and gone. Bo Bichette, his first big league home run. Any Roberts would do. <laughs> Luis Robert to center field, way back there. It carries and gets out of here. Jordans. Let me lower this down just a tick. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Get your packs inside the fancy box. And typically, yeah, typically you're, you, you know, you're, you're gonna get some pretty good stuff in the FOTLs. The FOTL, you know, it doesn't really advertise that it has just better hits but it usually does, especially because they're numbered. The stuff that was advertised this year was uh, low numbered, different low numbered things. It wasn't super crazy, but you know, you're guaranteed the low number hits. We went through the same song and dance with Diamond Kings. We got a lot of Diamond Kings FOTL and the hits were clearly better in the Diamond Kings FOTLs than the regular Diamond Kings. Okay, so we got the Rookie and Stars. Magnitude Mookie. There's a bow. Okay, we're looking good. Just a little base score bow and our first hit coming up. Let's drop it down from the top. He's got a helmet and a bat. We're checking boxes. That is, oh, 10 of 20, Jake Rogers. Woo! Look at that. Holy moly. Look at that. That is a beautiful card. 10 of 20, Jake Rogers. Put him on there. Wow. You see what I mean? Like Chronicles, it's just glorious. Out of all the Panini products, um, pro probably my favorite. Dylan Cease. Look at that, Bellinger, certified. Is that numbered? No, but there is always a lot of numbered stuff in the Chronicles. If you get the retail version, there's not as much numbered product, not as many numbered cards. That's a prism, that's a fancy prism. Mosaic, so they've got the mosaics in here this year. I don't think they had mosaics in last year's. Uh, I, don't re I don't recall, there's a Lux. I don't recall them having mosaic. So Lux, ooh, look at that. Lux is crushing. 
He's back up. They called him back up. He's getting it done. Show go. Bauer and into the good stuff. So we've got a Matt Chapman Spectra. Look at this. This is a real thicky too. Look at the thickness of that. That should be numbered. It is 47 of 75. It's a real beauty right there. Let me put them up there. Got something else on the back that I'm going to enjoy. Okay, Sean Murphy. We got a trout. That's good. Swimming about. Good card pile. Jalen Davis, Mosaic, Prism, and look at that. Look at that. Gavin Lux, Phoenix, numbered to 17. Wow. 11 of 17. That's a beautiful card. It's got to be like a gold or something fancy. I've got a pretty nice Gavin Lux collection going. This is it right here. Auto, low numbered stuff. Nothing too crazy, but just a nice little selection of unique Gavin Lux cards. Let me know what you think of the product down below. Did you get any last year? Hook me up with a like while you're at it, please. And subscribe, strikerbreaks.com. Go subscribe to the website. I'm going to be doing a giveaway with a huge box of cards, packs, all kinds of good stuff. Subscribe to strikerbreaks.com. It's free. You can also join the channel down below. It really helps me out. So I can keep making stuff for you guys. Six of 50, non Arenado Limited. So see what, I might, see what I mean about the numbered cards. They're already coming out. There's a Vladdy. Look at that. Another beautiful card, Spectra. Real thicky. Look how thick that is. Wow. Quality. We've got a Titan rookie. Titanium, rather. Michael Baez. Another thing about the Chronicles that I enjoy is usually the checklist is really good. Not a whole lot of scrubs to, to talk about. Obsidian. Yeah, these are these are awesome cards too. The Obsidian, noisy. That one's numbered to 50. Four of 50. Sheldon. Look at that. The glisten. Looks like a orange. Another trout. Plenty of trouts. Season ticket, contenders optic. So the good card pile is about as big as the like regular card pile. Put them next to each other so you can see. But another thing about the Chronicles that I enjoy is you get enough packs. So there's a good combination of hits to packs to cards. It's an enjoyable opening experience. If you were gonna dip your toes in the water for any Panini product, a lot of people go the Prism route or the Optic route, something like that. Maybe you dabble in some Select, but I think Chronicles is the way to go because Chronicles is what sold me over on Panini products. I wasn't a big fan at first and I didn't want anything to do with it really until Chronicles. All right, I'm gonna flip this one over. Got an Aquino right there. And boom, Todd Frazier, the Todd father. So there's our relic. That's a nice relic too. It's a prism. Shiny. Keep going here. We've got an Aquino, Puck, Cease, and Yamaguchi. All right, two packs left. If you're enjoying this, hook me up with a like and a subscribe. I appreciate everybody who's here watching. Let's keep it going. Oh, we got a numbered one. Jonathan Hernandez. Auto, I ran out of stands. Nothing crazy in the autograph department. What was that number two? Number to 75. Three out of 75. 
We got Kim, another Obsidian, Cody Bellinger, Black, Black Obsidian, and the Yordan Crusade. Another quality card, thick card stock, shiny, nice picture. Going in the good card pile. Last but not least, here we go. So we got two autos out of this. Should be an auto in here. Hopefully it's a good one. Haven't really gotten anything great out of here yet. And, oh baby! Yes, yes! The Origins Bow, 24 of 99, make my box. Thank you. On card auto too. Bam, bam, bam! <laughs> oh, make it. Make the box, Bo. Look at that. Big relic. Numbered to 99. On card auto. Yes. Checking all the boxes. I love it. That is going into the Bo PC. Sweet. That totally made it. I thought it was going to be a pitcher. Oh, yes. All right. We got a green Bryce. Is that numbered? No. But. Brennan McKay, Cracked Ice, that's numbered, 25 of 99, beautiful card, beautiful card, I love it, alright, quick recap, we got the Jake Rogers Auto, it's like a Cracked Ice, numbered to 20, got this Matt Chapman to 75, low numbered Gavin Lux, Beauty right there to 17. Todd Frazier. That is a prism. Jonathan Hernandez, Obsidian, number to 75. And the Bo Show Baby. 24 and 99. I love it. I hope you loved it. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. I will catch you later.